Hello, hello, Bethany from Just Be Scrap here. Welcome. Um, tonight I'm going to share with you a book that I did while on vacation in San Diego. I know that sounds crazy to do a book while you're on vacation, but I did. I took a mini little scrap pack of all of the essentials first and then my pad of paper that I wanted to use, some embellishments that I wanted to use, um, things like that. I kept it very, very small actually. I'm not sure how I did it because I don't know if I could do it again. I wish I would have like made a list or took a picture or something because I've never been able to reproduce this kit. Uh, but essentially that's what I did. I made myself a mini book kit. So I was able to scrap while I was on vacation. Um, the reason I did it was because I knew we were going to be on the beach. We were in a condo. Um, we were there for four or five days. And I can't go three or four days without doing some kind of something creative. Um, I knew there was going to be a couple nights that we were going to be in. And I am not a sit and watch TV type of girl. So this is what I did. They, um, the people that we were with were all from our job. So they all like to sit around and play cards. I'm not a card player. Um, so this is what I did while they play cards. And I came up with a really cute, cute mini book that I absolutely love. It's one of my favorite books. It is a four by four. I used um, coasters. The, just the chipboard coasters that you can buy. I did do um, some corner punches on each of my inside pages. Um, actually, my inside pages are just cardstock. Uh, I apologize. I was thinking they were all coasters. They're not. Just my covers are coasters. Um, but this is what I did. I had the paper. I took a square punch. I had some letters, some flowers, some little buttons. My circle punch, obviously, right there. My stapler. A um, couple pieces of ribbon that matched my paper line, a couple of my favorite stamps, some Seven Gypsies products I love, a little one of those little office tab thingies, and just made my book while I was there. Now my pictures I added in later, of course, because I was taking pictures while I was there and I hadn't, I didn't have access to a printer um, because I print all my stuff at home. So I did add the pictures in later, but everything was done when I got home. And I had a super cute book. As you can tell, I did not do the journaling yet. <laughs> I don't know that I will. I really like it without the journaling, actually, because it's just so darn cute. Um, but anyway, so that's what I came up with. And it was, you know what? It was really, I thought I was going to be really frustrated with not having all of my supplies there with me. But I found that I was able to be more creative when I challenged myself just to take a few of my favorite things at that time and make it work. And I tell you what, look at how, I mean, it, it got really creative. Like this one right here, I punched it out of that and then I used it as an embellishment. I mean, just, I was just being really, really creative that day. I used my circle punch and made it a little edge on there. I made it as a pocket and made it, you know, I mean, it just, I was being very creative and I was very happy that that, was something I could do while I was on vacation. So this one has actually been to the beach. It might even have some sand in it. I should have thrown sand all over it. So <laughs> anyway, I, I love the beach. So I one day I hope to live on the coast, but right now I can't afford to. So anyway, um, try it out sometime for sure and uh, see what you think about making a small kit and using just the things from that kit alone. And, and see what you come up with, because you might be more creative than you thought. You know, with all the tools and techniques and, and uh, you know, electronic gadgets and gadgets, we tend to forget that this is about using our creativity. So do it. I challenge you. Um, leave me a comment. Leave me something. Um, and let me know what you think. So, all right, check me out. My blog is justbescrap.com. And thank you. Thank you so much.